welcome back to another episode of the Long Gone News of Rock Show. Today I'm in Hollywood and I'm at the Academy Museum. I'm here to see the John Waters exhibition, The Pope of Trash, one of my favourite directors of all time. And he has an exhibition here, uh, which is running through to August the 4th. And here he is, the man himself. And yeah, I'm very excited to be here, like, because when I was in film school, John Waters was actually one of my biggest inspirations, uh, along with Ray Dennis Deckler and Russ Meyer and Ed Wood. And so uh, the fact that he's got an exhibition here while I'm here in Hollywood is pretty mind blowing. So I'm looking forward to it. There's a lot to see. And yeah, it's gonna be pretty damn exciting. If you are familiar with his works, uh, you might have already seen them without knowing it's a John Waters film, for example, Hairspray, Serial Mum, Cry Baby. They're the three big ones uh, that people may be familiar with. Those films are amazing. The soundtracks are incredible. But he's also done heaps of other movies, Polyester Pink Flamingos, Multiple Maniacs, Eat Your Makeup, Desperate Living, and uh, Cecil B. Demented, A Dirty Shame, yeah, etc. The list goes on. He's got so much stuff out, and they're all great. All great. Really, really cool stuff. And so, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this exhibit. So it's up on level four. Let's go. There he is. What you will see inside of this jet will make you literally sick. America. I mean, you. <laughs> really cool. Female Trouble is an amazing movie, but check this out. This is amazing. The actual electric chair prop from the movie. It is you that I murdered for, and it is you that I must die for. These posters are amazing, like really amazing. I want all of these in my home, all of them. This is incredible. Oh wow, this is awesome. This is incredible. The 
This is amazing. We have Ricky Lake's dress with the cockroaches on it. Oh, this is wild. That is so freaking cool. This is so cool. Debbie Harry's outfit in the movie. It's wild. This is really cool. Johnny Depp's guitar from the movie Crybaby. Wild. And the leather jackets. This is amazing. Oh my God, they've got the bra. <laughs> and the prison uniform. That's wild. Iggy Pop sitting in a bathtub in Crybaby. So funny. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> the signed photo from Richard Speck. <laughs> and the book. That's so cool. This is so cool. <laughs> Dottie Hinkle. There's the phone. That's so awesome. If you have never seen Cereal Mum, you need to do yourself a favor. It is incredible. They got Pecker's camera. This is so cool. That's wild. Cecil Mead demented costumes. This is awesome. That is amazing. When you signed our agreement, you yeah. the that was an awesome episode. It's called Homophobia. Hi, I'm John. Can I help you with anything? Yes, I have something that I'd like to sell. Please tell me it's your hair. This is cool. This is all merch that you can buy here. Impressive.
I think I need this T-shirt. So I just finished at the Academy Museum, John Waters exhibit, The Pope of Trash. And oh my God, it was incredible. You have to come and see this thing if you're a fan of John Waters movies. Uh, it is just incredible. Like everything is in there, costumes, props, the whole deal, scripts, uh, the whole thing. So if you get a chance, come on down here to, oh, there's Tracy Lords. There you go. Uh, so yeah, come on down to the Academy Museum here in Hollywood and check out this incredible museum exhibit of John Waters stuff. Uh, I, I actually got to meet John Waters once. I was very lucky. Uh, it's a really cool story. So my friend Hugo was out from Japan. We went to see this gig at a record store. And after that, we were hungry. So we thought we'll go get some curry. So we went and ate some curry. And then after that, I said, oh, let's take you to ACDC Lane in the city so that you can see the ACDC sign where it says ACDC Lane and you can get your photo there, whatever. So it's like, yeah, let's go. So we're walking there and I see this couple in front of me, uh, this lady and this guy walking. And, you know, we, they're walking quite slowish. So we decided to walk around them. And as I'm walking around, I start hearing the voice. And John Waters has a very specific voice that you can't mistake for anything. You know, like, it, you know it when you hear it. It's just it. Nobody sounds like John Waters. And then what happened was, is that I turned to my right like this, and I saw the pencil thin moustache, and I turned around and said, oh, my fucking God, it's John Waters. And he said, hi, nice to meet you. Anyway, so we ended up talking about, you know, movies and stuff and i told him i said you know i said hey john you know i don't mean to piss in your pocket but like you're my favorite movie director and he said please don't piss in my pockets because the airline has lost all my luggage and this is all i've got classic john waters he was so nice so cool got a photo with him it should be on the screen by now but yeah it was a wild night and then uh, i told him to go check out acdc lane i don't know if he did that but yeah so very cool but yeah, come on down to the Academy Museum and see this and hang out with, uh, yeah, the cast and crew <laughs> of the John Waters exhibit, The Pope of Trash, right here at the Academy Museum. Cheers.